Hey everybody, welcome to class today. Today is going to be part of our Yoga for Detox series, so it's going to be quite an advanced practice focusing on some really deep twists. If you enjoy these classes, please remember to like and subscribe, and if you have any class requests or want to know more about personalized programs, please head over to my Instagram. We're practicing today in Puerto Rico, so enjoy the sounds of the ocean. We're going to start today with some sun salutations at the top of the mat. Starting at the top of your mat into Dasana, ground down evenly through both feet. And take an inhale, raise the crown of the head and the sternum. And then as you exhale through the mouth, feel the shoulders fall away from the ears. One more like that, inhale through the nose, gather length. And then exhale, feel any tension leaving the body. And then start to breathe in and out through the nose, maybe inviting in Ujjayi Pranayama. Bring the hands to heart center, bow the head, maybe set an intention. We'll start with some sun salutations. Inhale, sweep the arms overhead. Exhale, fold. Inhale, right leg step. Exhale, plank. Hold the breath, lower to the belly. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, right leg. Exhale, fold. Inhale, raise. Exhale, fold. Inhale, left. Exhale, plank. Hold and lower. Inhale, Cobra. Exhale, Dog. Inhale, Left. Exhale, Fold. Inhale, Raise. Exhale, Fold. Inhale, Right. Exhale, Plank. Hold and lower. Inhale, Cobra. Exhale, dog. Inhale, right. Exhale, fold. Inhale, raise. Exhale, fold. Inhale, left. Exhale, plank. Hold and lower. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, dog. Inhale, left. Exhale, fold. Inhale, raise. Two more. Exhale. Inhale, right. Exhale. Hold and lower. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, right. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, inhale left, exhale, hold and lower, inhale, exhale, inhale left, exhale, inhale, last one, exhale, inhale right, exhale, Hold and lower. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale right. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale left. Exhale. Hold and lower. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale left. Exhale, inhale, hands to heart center, exhale, sink the hips, inhale, chair pose, hold for five breaths,
take an inhale, sink a little lower. Keep the knees and hips even. Exhale, sweep the right arm back, twist. Inhale, chair. Exhale, sweep the left arm. Inhale, two more each side. Exhale. Inhale, keep the hips sinking. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Last one. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Center the right hand. Exhale. Inhale, sweep the left arm up. Keep the pelvis even. Exhale, left hand to center. Inhale, sweep the right arm up. Twist, keep the hips even. Exhale, take it to the floor. One more each side. Inhale, left. Exhale. Inhale, right. Exhale. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, step to plank pose. Hold five breaths. Lengthen from the crown through to the heels, gentle drawing up of the lower belly. Bring the feet together, ground down through the right hand. Inhale, side plank to the right. Keep the hips stacking and as you exhale, reach the left arm underneath the right shoulder to the back of the room. Inhale, sweep it to the sky. Four more. Exhale, reach. Inhale, open. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. One more. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, plank pose, shift it to the left, inhale, side plank, exhale, keep the hips even, sweep the right arm underneath the left, inhale, open, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, one more. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, side plank. Exhale, plank. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, whole hand presses, plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, plank. Last one. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, plank. Exhale, down dog. Take the feet a footprint forward. Take the right hand, reach it for the left ankle. Look out underneath the left arm, twist. Stay here or start to lift the right leg up, coming into a twisted balance. Set the right foot down, right hand down. Take the left hand to the right ankle, twist. Stay here or start to lift the left leg, coming into a balance. Set the left leg down, downward facing dog, take an inhale, exhale to plank, inhale shift forward, exhale all the way to the belly. Take the fingers off to the side of the mat, tent the fingers, elbows to the sky, inhale peel up wide arm cobra, exhale drop the right shoulder, twist to the left, inhale through center, exhale to the right. Inhale through center, exhale left. Inhale center, exhale right. 
One more each side. Inhale, center. Exhale, left. Inhale, center. Exhale, right. Bring the hands back underneath the elbows. Take an inhale, untuck the toes. Exhale, plank pose. Take an inhale in plank. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, sweep the right leg up. Exhale, tap right knee, right elbow. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, right knee, left elbow. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, step it through. Inhale, stretch the sternum forward. Exhale, drop the back knee. Inhale, raise the arms up. Low lunge. And then as you exhale, take the right arm back, the left arm forward. Inhale, sweep it up through center. Exhale, right arm back, left arm forward, twist. Inhale through center. One more, exhale. Inhale. Exhale, plant the hands, start to shift the hips back. Ardha Hanumanasana. And then this time, plant the left hand underneath the shoulder. Inhale, sweep the right arm up, coming into a twist. Take one more inhale. Exhale, circle the hands down. Come back into a low lunge, lifting off the back knee. Inhale here. Exhale to plank. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Your choice. Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, downward dog. Sweep the left leg up. Inhale. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Inhale. Exhale, knee to nose round. Inhale. Exhale, left knee, right elbow. Inhale, exhale, step it through. Take an inhale, shine the chest forward, strong through the right leg. Exhale, drop the right knee. Inhale, raise up, low lunge. Exhale, left arm back, right arm forward, twist. Inhale, sweep it up. Exhale to twist. Inhale, sweep it up. One more. Exhale, twist. Inhale, sweep it up center. Exhale, send the hips back, straighten the front leg, Ardha Hanuman. Plant the right hand underneath the right shoulder, and as you inhale, sweep the left arm up as you draw the left hip back. Revolved Ardha Hanumanasana. Take one more inhale. Exhale, come forward, low lunge, lift the back knee. Inhale. Exhale, plank. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, downward dog. Look to the top of your mat, step, walk or float. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale to fold. Center the right hand, inhale, sweep the left arm up, twist and lengthen. Exhale to fold. Inhale, sweep the right arm up, twist and lengthen. Exhale to fold. Inhale, sink the hips, chair pose. Exhale, right arm back. Inhale, chair. Exhale, left arm back. Inhale, come all the way to standing. Exhale, left arm forward, right arm back, right hip forward. Inhale through center. Exhale, right arm forward, left arm back. Inhale through center. Exhale, swan dive forward. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, step walk or float, chaturanga. 
Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, downward dog. Inhale, sweep the right leg up. Exhale, tap knee to elbow. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, right knee, left elbow. Shoot the right foot through, fall in triangle. Inhale, sweep the left arm up. And then this time as you exhale, you're going to once again thread that left arm underneath the right. Inhale, open it up. Exhale, take it under. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, fall in triangle. Exhale, plant the left hand, step it back, three-legged downward dog. Inhale, exhale, step it through. Set yourself up for crescent. Inhale, raise up, crescent lunge. Exhale, take the right arm back, the left arm forward, twist, keep the hips even. Inhale, crescent. Two more, twisting on your exhale. Inhale, crescent. Exhale, straighten the front leg, extended pyramid, sending the right heel towards the floor, grounding through, sorry, the left heel towards the floor, grounding through the right big toe. And take an inhale, lengthen through the spine. Exhale, sink into the right knee, low lunge. Plant the left hand. Inhale, sweep the right arm up for a low lunge, simple twist. Inhale here. Exhale, step the right foot behind the left knee for Pajva Anjaneyasana, uh, variation of side plank, rather. Take an inhale here. Exhale, plank pose. Option, keep the right leg floating. Take it through your vinyasa. Adhavashastasana is what I meant to say. Inhale, sweep the left leg up. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, cross. Shoot the left leg through, fall in triangle. Inhale, sweep the right arm up. Exhale, thread it underneath the body. Four more. Inhale. Exhale. And take the last three on your own breath. Inhale, fall in triangle. Exhale, plant the hand. Step it back, three-legged dog. Inhale. Exhale, step the left leg through. Set yourself up for crescent. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, right arm forward, left arm back. Inhale, crescent. Two more. Inhale, crescent. Exhale, extended pyramid pose, sending the right heel down. The left hip draws in and under. Neck and shoulders are relaxed. Take an inhale to lengthen. Exhale, low lunge, plant the right hand. Inhale, open, simple twist. And then as you exhale, step the left toes behind the right knee for a version of side plank, sweeping the left arm forward. Take an inhale. And then exhale, circle the hand down towards the floor. Option, single leg vinyasa.
Look towards the top of the mat. Step walk or float to Malasana. Sink the hips down, hands to heart center. And take the left hand down as you inhale, sweep the right arm up, coming into a twist. You can stay here or you can reach the left arm in front of the left shin. Wrap the right hand behind the back, reaching for the bind. Keep the weight even in through the feet. If you've got the bind, inhale, release long. Exhale, come to center. Take the right hand down as you inhale, sweep the left arm up, opening into a twist. Stay here or reach the right arm in front of the right shin, snaking the left hand behind the back, reaching for the hand bind. Keeping open and broad through the chest. If you've got the bind, inhale, release. Exhale, come to center. Take one more inhale through center. Exhale, fold forward, parallel the feet. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale to fold. Inhale, chair pose. This time as you exhale, sweep the right arm back, raise up onto the toes, balance twisting chair. Inhale, release the heels to chair. Exhale, raise the heels, sweep the left arm back. Inhale, let the heels go. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, step walk or float through a vinyasa or skip it. Inhale, sweep the right leg up. Exhale, step it through. Set up for warrior one this time, heel to heel. Inhale, raise up, warrior one. Hold for five breaths. Setting up a strong, solid foundation for our Surya Namaskar B. Take one more inhale, lengthen, and then exhale, straighten through the front leg, come into Purvoshanasana, drawing back through the right hip, grounding down through the outside edge of the left foot, folding over straight front leg. Take an inhale, and then as you exhale, step the right foot back, option single leg vinyasa, or take it straight to downward dog. Always adding or subtracting poses that your body calls for. Inhale, sweep the left leg. Exhale, step it through. Set yourself up for warrior one, and on your inhale, raise up for five breaths. Take an inhale, and then as you exhale, fold forward over that straight front leg, grounding down through the back heel, gently draw the left hip in and underneath you as you send the sternum towards the toes, thinking of length as opposed to depth. Using your forward folds to calm, calm the mind, letting go of anything that you don't need. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, step it back, take it through your vinyasa or straight to dog.
Look towards the top of the mat. Step, walk or float to Malasana. Inhale in Malasana. Exhale, sink the hips. So we've got some options. You might need a strap. You can stop anywhere along the way. Take the left hand down. Inhale, sweep the right arm up. You might stay here. Or you might grab the bind around the left shin again, maybe using a strap. And then you're going to start to shift the weight to the right foot. We're going to come to stand on the right foot. So ground down strongly through the right foot. Come onto the toes of the left foot and come all the way to standing, holding the bind if you can. So you might stay standing tall. You might start to twist the torso towards the right, opening up through the left shoulder. Or you might want a little bit of compression keeping the right knee straight start to bend forward almost as if you're doing Marichyasana but in standing take one more breath wherever you are and if you're in the balance we're slowly going to come down as gracefully as we can back into Malasana slowly lowering both feet down to the floor and then releasing the bind if you had it, come back into your yogi squat, inhale. Exhale, take the right hand down, sweeping the left arm up. Maybe stay or maybe take the bind around the right shin. You can hang out here or start to shift your weight onto the left foot, walking that right foot in until you can come onto the right toes. Ground down through the left foot and start to come to standing on the left leg. Staying upright, maybe twisting the chest towards the left this time. Or maybe starting to fold forward as if you're seated on the ground, except that it's much, much harder. One more breath. And then wherever you are, you're going to exhale, slowly make your way back to your yogi squat. And if you've got the bind, take an inhale, release it long. Exhale, back through center. One more breath here, inhale. Cleansing, open mouth, exhale. Fold forward, plant the hands, inhale, halfway lift as you parallel the feet. Exhale, sink the hips, fold forward. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, raise the heels, sweep the right arm back, twist. Inhale, chair. Exhale, raise the heels, left arm, twist. Inhale, chair. Exhale, fold. Surya Namaskar B. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, vinyasa. Right leg steps, warrior one on your inhale. Exhale, plant the hands with or without a vinyasa. Make your way to downward dog. Left leg steps, raise up, warrior one on your inhale. Exhale, with or without a vinyasa, take it to downward dog. Look towards the front of the mat. Step, walk, float. Inhale, halfway with lengthen. Exhale to fold. Inhale, chair. Exhale, heels raise, right arm. Inhale, chair. Exhale, raise the heels, left arm. Inhale, chair. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, vinyasa. Step the right leg forward. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, with or without a vinyasa to dog. Step the left leg. Inhale, warrior one. 
With or without a vinyasa as you exhale, downward dog. Look towards the top, step, walk, float. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale to fold. Inhale, chair. Exhale, right arm, raise the heels. Inhale, chair. Exhale, left arm, raise the heels. Inhale, chair. Exhale, fold. Follow, finish this one on your own, following your breath. Hold for a couple of breaths in downward facing dog. Look towards the top of the mat, step walk or float to Malasana. Inhale here. Exhale. Bring the feet together, set yourself up for crow pose. Plant the hands, snuggle the knees, and then shift the weight coming into crow. And we'll hold for five breaths. And then step, walk, float, make your way to downward dog. Inhale, sweep the right leg up. Exhale, right knee, right elbow. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, right knee, left elbow. Shoot it through, floating fallen triangle. Keep the right leg lifted. Take an inhale, exhale, bend the left knee, send the hips towards the left heel. Inhale, floating fallen triangle. Two more like that, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale. Exhale, plant the left hand, inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, step it through for crescent. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, sternum to thumbs. Exhale, cross left elbow to the outside of the right knee. Strongly engage the left thigh. Send the crown of the head and the tail away from each other. Option to open the arms. Option to wrap the left arm underneath the legs, the right arm behind the back and grab a bind. And then look down at the right foot, slowly, calmly step the left foot to meet the right, come into twisting chair, knees are even, the left hip draws back, head is in the midline. Option here, split the arms, right arm up, left arm down, do what feels good for your body. And then look down, look at the left foot, keep the right elbow and the the left elbow and the right knee glued together. Start to come up onto the right toes and then start to come up into standing. So we're kind of doing a funky balancing standing twist. Try and get the spine as long as you can. Two more breaths. And then we're going to reverse it so slowly, whoops, slower than me, take it back down to twisting chair, take an inhale, look down towards the right foot as you exhale, step the left leg back to twisting crescent, take an inhale, 
Exhale, plant the hands with or without a vinyasa. Make your way to downward dog. Inhale, left leg sweep. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Inhale, take it back. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, take it back. Exhale, left knee, right elbow. Shoot the leg through, floating fallen triangle. Take an inhale. And then exhale, bend the right knee, send the hips towards the heel. Inhale. Two more. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, plant the right hand. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, step it through for crescent. Inhale, sweep yourself up for crescent. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, sternum to thumbs. Exhale, twist, hook the right elbow to the outside of the left knee. Strongly sending energy back through the right heel, hugging the left hip underneath you. Option to split the arms, option to reach the right arm underneath the left leg, the left hand behind to grab the bind. And then look down towards the left foot, slowly, calmly step the right foot up to meet it for twisting chair. Even off through the knees and the pelvis, drawing the right hip in line with the left, sending the sternum forward, option to split the arms here. And then looking down towards the right foot, imagine that the right elbow is glued to the left knee. Come up onto the left toes, send the weight into the right foot and then slowly start to come to standing. Slowly reverse the movement, coming back into your twisted chair. Take an inhale. As you exhale, step the right leg back, twisting crescent. Take an inhale to lengthen here. Exhale, with or without a vinyasa, make your way to downward dog. Look towards the top, step, walk or float. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale to fold. Take the peace fingers, hook them around the big toes, feet are hips distance apart. Inhale, pull the sternum forward. Exhale, bend the elbows off to the side, forward fold. And take a moment to slow down the breath, shake the head yes and no. Release any tension in the jaw. Maybe give the lips a bit of a flutter. And then shift the weight to the left foot. Take the left hand to the left hip. Take an inhale. And then as you exhale, come to standing, holding on to the right big toe. Take an inhale. And then as you exhale, start to extend the right leg out in front of you, drawing the right shoulder back in line with the left. And then from here, you're either going to reach the left hand through the outside of the left foot or the outside of the left knee and start to take the right arm back, coming into a twist, dropping the right hip down in line with the left. And then from here, slowly with control, you're going to release the right leg behind you. Start to hinge the torso forward, coming into warrior three. Extending the arms out in front of you if that's available to you. Right toes point towards the floor, neck is relaxed.
take one more inhale and then as you exhale standing splits on the left leg send the right leg up maybe take the left hand behind the left calf maybe the right hand to the left ankle one more inhale exhale release right leg to meet left take the peace fingers around the left big toe take the hand to the right hand to the right hip shift the weight to the right leg and then come to standing up on the right foot extending the left leg out in front of you when you get there using a tree as balance if you need to And then from here, taking the right hand either to the outside edge of the right, the left foot or the left knee, taking the left arm back, coming into a twist. Left leg can be bent or straight, keeping length in through the spine is the most important part. And then slowly derotating, send the left leg back behind you, hinge the torso forward, coming into warrior three. Maybe the arms can extend out in front of you for length. And take one more inhale. And then as you exhale, fold forward, standing split. Maybe the right hand comes behind the right calf. Maybe the left hand can come to the ankle. Take one more inhale. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, sink the hips, chair pose. Exhale, keep the hands in front of you, raise up onto the toes and start to sink the hips all the way down to the heels. And bring the hands to heart center. We're setting up for twisting crow. Swing the knees to the left, hook the elbows to the outside of the right knee. So you might stay here in this nice deep little twist or plant the hands like chaturanga arms. The weight is going to come to rest on the back of the left tricep. Start to bend into the arms as you shift the weight. Maybe lifting the feet off. Maybe sending the bottom leg forward, the top leg back. And then maybe shooting it back to Chaturanga. Making your way through a vinyasa. We'll meet back at the top of the mat in a little squat. And this time swinging the legs to the opposite direction. Hook the right elbow to the outside of the left knee. Maybe stay here gathering length in your little squat. Or plant the hands and come into flying twisted crow on this side. Maybe taking Chaturanga from here. We all meet in a forward fold at the top. And however you got there, make your way to a forward fold at the top of the mat. Take an inhale, lengthen. Exhale to fold. Plant the hands, step, walk or float. Make your way to downward dog. Inhale, sweep the right leg up. Exhale, this time cross it straight to fallen, floating fallen triangle. Inhale. Exhale, hips to heels one time. Inhale, back. Exhale, plank. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, step it through. Set up warrior one. Inhale. Exhale, straighten the front leg. 
Pop the back foot in a few inches, square the hips. Inhale, reach the left arm up. You might need a block. Exhale, hinge forward halfway, gathering length. If you need a block, take it either to the inside or the outside of the right foot. Plant the left hand down and then start to turn the torso towards the right. Maybe the right arm can come up towards the sky for twisting triangle. Even weight through both feet, keep both hips on a level plane. One more inhale. And then exhale, fold it forward. Take the right hand forward and underneath the shoulder. Come up into half moon to start with, sending the left leg up, opening the chest to the left hand side. And then start to rotate the left hand down, coming into standing split even off through the pelvis maybe with a block underneath the left hand start to keep the pelvis even as you rotate the left ribs towards the right maybe the right arm can come up towards the sky for twisting Adha Chandrasana One more inhale, exhale, fold it at the top of the mat. Inhale, chair pose, exhale, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, make your way to downward dog. Left leg sweeps on the inhale. Exhale, send it through, floating fallen triangle. Inhale. Exhale, hips to heel. Inhale, fall and triangle. Exhale, single leg plank. Inhale, three legged dog. Exhale, step it through, warrior one alignment. Inhale, raise up. Exhale, straighten the front leg, hands to hips. Pop the back foot in a little bit. Inhale, raise the right arm up, gather length. Exhale, tilt forward at the pelvis, halfway. Inhale, gather more length, hug that left hip underneath you. And then as you exhale, twist the torso towards the right, sending the right hand down maybe to your block, inside or outside the foot. Maybe the left arm comes up, maybe it stays on the hip. Keep grounding down through the right foot, three more breaths. Inhale, exhale, plant the left hand, start to lift the right foot, coming into half moon pose, Adha Chandrasana, opening the right arm to the sky. Take an inhale, and then as you exhale, rotate the right hand down, come first into standing split. Even off through the pelvis, ground down through the right leg, uh, right hand, and then start to rotate the right ribs towards the left. Maybe the left arm comes up. Wherever you are, draw the left hip back, the crown of the head forward, and strongly lift the right leg towards the sky. Take one more inhale, and then exhale, fold it forward at the top of the mat. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale to fold. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, raise onto the toes. 
and then start to sink the hips all the way down towards the heels. Send the arms forward as you slowly reach the torso forward, the heels down and make your way into Navasana boat pose. Take an inhale here, join the palms. And as you exhale, take the hands to the right, the legs to the left. Inhale through center. Exhale, legs to the right, hands to the left. Inhale through center. Exhale, keep twisting on your exhales. Go for a few more rounds. One more each side. Inhale through center. Exhale, Ardha Navasana. Turn the toes to the right. Inhale through center. Exhale, toes to the left. Inhale through center. Two more times each side to your own pace. And then inhale back to Navasana. Exhale. Cross at the ankles. Plant the hands. Pick everything up. And then shoot it back through a vinyasa. Make your way to downward dog. Inhale, sweep the right leg up. Exhale, step the right knee behind the right wrist. Coming into single pigeon. Inhale here, and then exhale, start to walk the hands over to the right, twisting single pigeon. And then from here, you're going to sweep the left leg around, plant it to the outside of the right knee, Ardha Matsyandrasana. From here, you're going to make your way into Gomukhasana. So just slide the right leg over the top of the left, outside edges of the feet to the floor. Take an inhale here. Hands to heart center as you exhale. You're going to hook the right elbow to the outside of the left knee, coming into a twist. If that's too much for you, you can stick with normal Gomukhasana. And then from here I invite you to play. So this is a nice place to maybe take a tripod headstand from. Otherwise, however you want to make your way back to Downward Dog, we'll meet there in five to 10 breaths. And then from downward dog, step the left knee forward for single pigeon. Inhale, raise up through the chest. And then exhale, walk the hands over towards the left for a twist. the hands back to center shift the weight to the left hip stamp the right foot over and outside of the left knee for Ardha Matsyandrasana 
right hand behind you, inhale, send the left arm up, exhale to twist. And from here, just slide the right knee on top of the left, coming into Gomukhasana legs. Take the hands to the heart center, inhale, exhale, twist, left elbow hooks to the outside of the right knee. And slowly unwind yourself and again I invite you to play maybe making your way into a tripod headstand or a handstand or any sort of inversion we all meet in downward dog in about 10 breaths From your downward dog, step, walk or float, make your way to your back. And then draw the knees up to tabletop, take an inhale, hands behind the head, exhale, lift the shoulders. We're going to take five each side, slow bicycles, twisting on your exhale, inhaling through center. Once you've done your five, drawing the knees in towards the chest, take the hands off to capital T or cactus and then let the knees fall over towards the left side, gently grounding down through the right shoulder as you move the right hip towards the left. Inhale yourself through center. Exhale, let the knees fall over to the right, grounding down through the left shoulder. Inhale, draw the knees towards center. Take happy baby pose.
and then draw the knees in towards the chest squeeze the nose towards the knee contract every muscle in your body and then release Shavasana taking one final nice deep inhale through the nose and letting it go through the mouth And taking a few minutes here to calm the mind, observe the thoughts without judgment and without attachment. Today, as you go forward, maybe you be calm in your thoughts, peaceful in your words, and joyous in your heart. Namaste.